Hey guys, I'm LB, and let's check out Underground Part 5 by Ben77. Underground theme, medium difficulty, and there's a solution video. Alright. Let's get so, started then. Welcome to Amateur. You're here because we want the best. And you're it. You're it. You're it. Nope. Couldn't keep a straight face. Alright. Interesting. We get cleansing gel for some reason. I wonder what that'll be for. And then we have an ultra thick. Ultra thick portal surface for some reason. I'm sure that's to. I'm sure it's because it's got padding in case you fall on it and break your neck or something, just so that it's padded. Nah, aperture wouldn't be so kind. And we've got this teeter totter mechanism, which I'm assuming. Oh, does does this have physics with the the cleansing gel bomb? Is this gonna launch us like a catapult? That's clever. See here. Let's see if it does what I think it's gonna do. Indeed it does! Interesting. That takes some hammer scripting. Right. Well, in that case, we'll want to juggle it for a bit. And hope it doesn't lose too much of its momentum in the meantime. We We did it! Remember, do not leave your belongings here. Right. Okay, my belongings are over there, and I didn't leave them. All right. If you're allergic to peanuts, you might want to tell somebody now because this next test may turn your blood into peanut water for a few minutes. On the bright side, if we can make this happen, they're going to have to invent a new type of Nobel Prize to give us. So, hang in there. That's weird. Why is the audio like all over the place depending on where I walked? Strange. I I think the soundscape is sort of not properly set up here. Right, this has got a weird border on it. Oh, and now we've got some classic recon- uh, no, not reconstruction, classic old aperture music. Slowly fading in. Interesting. Ooh, that's a nice sight to see. Looks like more breakable glass over there. Not sure what this is for just yet, but I'm certain it's for something. Probably bounce gel if I had to guess. That's definitely for bounce gel. Uh, what's up here? What could possibly be up here. Absolutely nothing. So I'm guessing that rotates when you press the button. Yeah, probably. What's up here? A whole bunch of stuff. This is the exit condition up here. This is how we get out of here. Alright. And this is... Oh, conversion gel, huh? Really, now? Well, we can't really do much with it from here, I don't think, because we've got these fizzlers turned on. There's nowhere I can stand or look to shoot this that will work out for me. Does this one turn off? It does not appear so. Does this one turn off? Does not appear so. Huh. I'm not actually sure right now how to deal with this one. But maybe we need to like bounce and jump and shoot over or something? Then how would we press the button? Are, are we able to press this from inside here, I wonder? Oh. Oh, this is not putting me in a safe space. No. Okay, so that's not part of the solution, then. Huh. Interesting, interesting. What was that? Cleansing gel? Yeah, I guess that must be if we get a cube wet. Look at that. Weird glass behavior. Why does zooming in change it that dramatically? I don't think that's how glass works. But, uh, I'm no rocket scientist. I didn't go to the moon or storm a beach. There's a button in here, what does this do? Oh, that's not even a gel bomb, that's just... that's just gel. Well, can we get some gel there? Is 
that didn't do anything. What about there? Maybe we can bounce off that. Why does it sound like there's gel landing here? Oh, I think that's like a bug with the portal sound that makes... Yeah, that gel, when it hits the water, it sounds really loud here. Yeah, it sounds like it's coming from over here. That's just- that's just portals being buggy. Right, uh... Let's do this. Whee! That did nothing. Although... We jump into that. Almost. Almost. Not quite, though. Not... quite... unfortunately. Yeah, not quite. Well, that's sad. And this is specifically put here to stop me from doing what I wanted to do. Can we see that from over there? I wonder. Yeah, but it's not too useful that we can. Cause what I wanted to do was I wanted to use this area here. But, I'm not seeing a good way to do that, honestly. And the fact that we have to use portals to get in there, to press the button... ...means that we can't really do much... ...to, like, get a portal here and get gel in there at all, so... I think right now, we need to figure out how to... ...how to break the glass. How would we break the glass? I'm pretty sure the glass is supposed to be broken, so... Just don't know how, exactly. <laughs> Body slam! Nope, nothing. Okay, that didn't work. Whee! That also doesn't work. Okay. Huh. Wow, that is a l that is a large hole in the ceiling. I wonder what that's about. I am genuinely not sure what I'm meant to be doing here. though. Like, if I could launch out of here at a high rate of speed, I think I could break the glass, but... Where would I get such velocity from in the first place? Because I can't see this portal surface from launching out of that, I don't think. Let's just see what we can see. This is the only floor portal surface that I'm aware of. Yeah, I can't really see much, can I? I suppose I could see that. Yeah, sure, let's try that. Uh... Let's go. There we go. Okay, so that's how we do this part. Right. Now, which portal surface... I guess the only one I can use is that one, right? Do I really want to get... I guess I do want to get conversion gel there, yeah. Cause I can easily get regular gel there again, so... Let's do that. 
And one more for good measure. Alright, now. Now that I've done that, I think... I think... we can make some sort of semblance of progress here. Yes, I do believe this is a semblance of progress. And... broken glass! Excellent! Exactly what I wanted. Right. How would we do that here, though? That's a good point question. I think... that- I think that is a very good question indeed, actually. Who knows? Bid 77 knows, and... Bumbly Bumbly knows. They know. They know. Wait, so now that I've done this, what's... What, uh... Hmm. How does this help me? <laughs> I mean, I can get the gel without using portals now, is that what I wanted? Like, maybe? Maybe that's what I wanted? Not entirely sure. What? Come on. There we go. Well, come on now, let me through here. Where do I want to get gel? Not entirely sure. Do I want to get gel on the cube, maybe? Maybe. How would I accomplish that? I guess I would have to launch it out of there. Yeah, that looks like that's exactly what it's designed for. How do we get conversion gel up there, though? That's still a mystery and a half. Huh. Well, anyway, we can try and get some gel in here, I suppose. Not sure how helpful it'll be, but we can try and do it. Oh, that's... Mm, wow. I didn't realize it was that much. That, that much velocity. Okay then. Uh, hmm. That's honestly not helpful. Honestly not helpful at all. Yeah. I mean, that gets us a tiny bit extra velocity if we want it, but not useful. Just an observation room. Huh. Definitely want gel here, right? But how do we get it here? Will that work? Surely that won't work. I don't believe you. I don't believe it should work. It shouldn't work, but it might, unfortunately, work. Yeah, it looks like it's not working. Ah oh, well, it was worth a shot. Oh wait, from this angle, it looks like it was working. Well, oh, crap. I didn't expect it to work at all. Aha! That does not at all angle the way I expected it to. I really wish there'd be, like, dotted at dashed outlines, you know, of where stuff would move to next, so that you would know and be able to plan for it incorrectly and all that. Alright, so that's... that answers that question. Right. Can't we see that from up here? Or do I need to do any shenanigans? I might have to shoot that... in midair. Unfortunately. Alright, so. Let's redo this. There we go. That. Nope, nope. That. That. And then this. We gotta stand here first. Let's go ahead and save. Oh, come on! At least now I know that's a thing. 
Actually, I do wonder what that extra velocity does for me now. Oh, that- that's the ceiling, if I ever saw one. Yeah, it just makes me hit the ceiling, so... At least this makes it so I don't have to do so much portal manipulation here. Hey! Made the shot, excellent. Wow, that... gravity is not as strong as I thought it was, apparently. I did not expect that to work, even though it looked like it was supposed to work. Right, so now that we've done that... We can do this! Bam. Ta-da! One more for good measure. There we go. Right, so... Now, theoretically, we should be able to just... Jellify the cube and have it break the glass for us, I believe. So let's try that out. Oh, yep, there we go, it's been jellified. Oh, and it totally broke the glass. Very easily, in fact. And that's what this is here for. Nice. We could also just respawn the cube, but whatever. So let's take our cube and... I guess now we can just leave, right? Yeah, we should be able to just get out of here. Well, that's weird. Now I don't have the sound effects for holding the cube? I didn't know that could happen. <laughs> You know, out of curiosity... I'll set that up there for now, but out of curiosity... I wonder what would happen... Actually, no. I wonder what would happen... If... What is this aligned with? Like that? Ah, whatever. I'm sure I'll figure it out. Which direction do I go? Oh, I hit the side. Try that again. Oh, come on. That's a very small... very small collision, I must say. Yay! Let's- let's try that, but angle this portal... like that. Yes. That's the fun way to get up there. <laughs> Once again, we got it to work once, we can get it to work a second time. I don't even know if portals on angled services aim assist at all, to be honest. I'm pretty sure they don't. I need to enter the portal more from the center, it appears, or from this side at least. Oh, come on! That totally should've worked! Game. Come on, game. And... Ah! So close. We're gonna do it, though. I wanna do it, it's fun. Trust me. Oh, that was a complete failure. <laughs> Let's try this. One more time. We did it once. We did it once, and that's what matters. Oh, come on! Alright, fine. That's enough. That is way too tight of a collision, I guess. Right. Yeah, this is definitely an improvement over the prior maps, in terms of challenge and quality. So, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye! Control room, huh? Sure if I didn't miss an Easter egg.